Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm does this. Today I'm going to be opening my third Pokemon Sword and Shield Brilliant Stars booster box. My first two booster boxes were stacked, so with this one also be stacked. Without further scooby ado, <laughs> let's find out. All right, guys. So the first two booster boxes were stacked. I'm hoping this one is too. If you want to see those first two, links will be in the description down below. Let's get straight into this one. Alright, so I don't know why I'm doing the, the display piece part. Just get some used to it. Alright, so stuck them there. Um, as always, guys, in this... Oh, I need to clean my hands first. Let me clean my hands. So with the shrink wrap flake one, Let's continue. Arceus first pack will be a first pack magic. Yeah, so my first two boxes. Oh my days, guys. Stacked. Will this one also be stacked? Um, I think I'll say as well, call cards, booster boxes, because these are generally longer videos. I, I won't be doing double call cards. Those are safe for the shorter openings. But yeah, guys, oh my days, brilliant stars. This set is just absolutely amazing. Reverse Alchemy and a Golurk. You can go lurk over there, Golurk. So far, in the two booster boxes, I've pulled mostly, mostly stuff that I can use for the binder. Not that many double hits, which I'm really happy about. Bang. Tempest Ambition, Torkoal, Trap Inch, Piplup, Shroomish, Purloin, Duskull, Reverse Gloria, and a Braylon. At this point as well, I think I'm kind of running out of topics to bloody talk about. Lightning Energy. Let me know in the comments down below guys, how your pulls have been. How much you've opened. All that good jazz. What your chase cards are, reverse Wem Wemadam yeah. and aluminium. Okay, so there's my first double up of a V card. At this point as well, I've pulled kind of pretty much a lot, if not most of the V cards. Maybe I have a couple left, so I'm bound to be getting doubles now. Would happily take the ones that I need left, but at this point, I think. With two booster boxes being opened. I'm going to be pulling doubles now. High five. Even on the ultra rares. I'll probably be pulling doubles. The trainer galleries. With not much being in the set. I think I'll be start, I'll start pulling the doubles. Throw, reverse and the boss's orders follow. At this stage. I've opened I think. I would say. Almost all the products. I have. A few more. Um, I still have the sleeve boosters to pick up. I do have the build and battle kits. One of build and, the build and battle stadiums coming through, which I don't know why they delayed it. Reverses boss orders and ice cube. Because those build and battle stadiums are technically pre release kits, right? So instead of it coming out two weeks before the set, it's coming out two weeks after the set. So, I don't understand that logic there, but you know, it is what it is. So, yep, two building battle stadiums, or well, a couple, a few. Um, the sleeve boosters, and then I still need to get the half booster boxes, guys. The booster boxes with 18 packs, reverse breezo, and then it looks like wow, this looks like in this booster box, the left half might not be that stacked. Or this booster box in general might not even be that stacked. Because in my first two, the left side of the booster box was stacked. Sorry, just bang the mic. I've been banging the mic a lot lately as well. V-Star, which doesn't mean anything. I've had a theory as well, if you've seen my last opening. Where in booster boxes, these don't mean anything. You're not really going to get anything from them. But... In single booster packs, triple pack blisters, anything that's not a booster box, 
you're gonna get a hollow one above obviously more testing needs to be done but right now that's my theory with the v-star markers in the booster box they're just regular random cards just inserted into them or i guess you are guaranteed a form of hit anyway so the v-stars are just inserted randomly but yeah, in those free pack blisters, checking blisters, sleeve boosters, I think. Reverse blunder policy. What the hell? Look at the text on that. It's like really bold and then it's kind of smudgy as well. So reverse blunder policy, which I actually need. And the mute. I really wish this was a hollow. This would look so cool in a hollow. Almost halfway through the left side and we have just a V to show for it. Wow. Okay, so is this booster box gonna be jibbed? Literally, I've done this in every video. What? I think it's because the cars get stuck together. You idiot! We have a Holo Motres, which I finally pulled as well after so long. Well, I pulled it in my last video as well, so darkness energy, but we get a training gallery at least. Chinchino, cleansing gloves, Lotso, Grandma, Sneasel, the Doof, Electabuzz, Chimeco, and the Reverse Axio. Also, guys, I would like to know in the comments down below do you guys prefer just getting straight to the hits? Or do you actually like the suspense in like doing the four pack trick? Or the four card trick or whatever the card, short card tricks or even just let's say me babbling talking about maybe stories pulls that kind of stuff reverse go to yes something new for the binder a cute nice looking full up finally as well full up pokemon this is my first full up in three booster boxes well yeah three booster boxes Finally, a full art and a Pikachu as well, which is really nice. Oh my days, this is really, really beautiful. Ooh, yes. Okay, so this, just from this, I think I like this booster box already. At least it's not. At least it's something that I don't have. Anything. I've already pulled my chase card, which is the Houndoom character rare. I guess if it's in terms of trainer gallery, I just went off topic again. Um, yeah. Before I get back to that, do you guys prefer watching just going straight to the hits, no diddle daddle, or do you guys actually kind of enjoy the excitement with? Yahoo! Finally, yes, I have pulled all of the evolution trainer gallery cards. Yes! And this card looks really nice, but it's really badly cut and. Oh my. Look, look, look. Oh, keep banging the mic, sorry guys. Can you see that? What the hell? Some badly. I swear, the Pokemon quality is getting worse and worse. In Japan, the Japanese cards, anyway, they're coming with print lines now. In English, off center like hell, cut like the corners are bad. The you got keep hanging the mic. I got a new sort of setup, so it's closer than it was before. So I keep hanging it. Um, flaky stuff. What the hell? Okay, but anyway, Jolteon Yahoo! double banger, double banger. Yes, the rude V. Yes, two cards that I need for the binder. This is what I like guys, this is what I like. This is what I like, that Luminion. Could have been something else. Would have happily taken a different form of V. I think in terms of Vs I still need Simiseer. Raikou. Uh, Whimsicott. Um... Mimikyu, if I didn't say that already, which I feel like I did. Uh, 
again, I went off top again because of bloody pause. High five. Was I still talking about the content? Yeah. Look, for me, of course, when I watch people open cards, I kind of pref I do prefer them going to the hit. Sometimes reverse parry, which I need. Sometimes I watch the content for the content creator. But and then sometimes I just watch just to see the pulls. Like it depends, I guess. Maybe some people like me, if the content creator is someone that I like, watch them for the content creator. And then if the content's there as well, then double the double the entertainment. But then there's some that I just feel I just watch the hits. I mean if you're one of those that watch my content Oh, this is my second one. Definitely better, better centering than the one I pulled before. But we have a secret rare gold magma basin. Definitely better centering than the one I had before. I think slightly off on the left, but still. So we have what would have spoiled my chances of getting a gold Arceus now. It's could have been a gold Arceus. Okay. So, secret record, Magma Basin, yeah. If you guys watch me, for me and the content, I appreciate you very much. But yeah, I just wanted to know. Let me know in the comments down below, guys. Let me know, let me know. What kind of content you prefer. Also, it could give me a little insight into what I could start producing later on down the line. Reverse the choreo. The text is that is just the text on that is just I don't know. Is it supposed to be like that? Anyway, reverse with Lucario, which I need. And the hollow dust no. And then what was the other topic I was talking about before I wanted to go back to it? I completely forgot now. This is multitasking at its finest, guys. Multitasking at its finest. Trying to talk about stuff or opening cards or getting distracted by cards and then trying to keep you guys engaged and entertained cross form chimcha reverse heatran and a luxury i think for me the fun part is obviously to the suspense me going through these cards like for myself of course i don't want to just plow through all the cards and just find the hits where's the enjoyment in that like i just want to be you know open up how many cards are in there 10 so go through 10 cards and then at the last part if there's a big hit or if there's a hit like now you see that see this is this is the enjoyment factor when you're opening it for yourself anyway but when you're watching it, sometimes it depends. But we have the Trainer Gallery, Full Art, Cafe Master. Yes, nice. Happily take that and I'll worm with them. Nice, nice. So, mm, second, I mean, the second half of the left stack is actually still there wow so two full arts two v's and a trainer gallery nice it's like i'm speaking things into existence right now with what i was just talking about just going through the cards going through the cards and then getting to nothing like one Yeah, I mean, I don't know if, like, in a terms of a content creation side, and in a personal side, things are a bit different. If it was personal, like if I was doing it just for myself, off camera, would I go straight to the hit? 
the younger me, yes. The younger me, all I did was go straight to the hit, just pull it apart, look for the Charizard. But nowadays, I actually prefer the suspense, the enjoyment of is there going to be something behind? Is it this one? I think it's this one. So, is there going to be something behind this one? Reverse Moltres. For me, yes, because I need the reverse version as well. So, perfect, nice. And then there is something behind this one. Spoiler alert. What is it going to be? Bramble V. Sorry, bang the mic again. I keep banging the mic. I'm getting excited about this. Really excited. And my tangent is even hyping me up even more. So, there's our first double up of a Gramble V as well. Let's put you there. Right, so moving on to the right side. Will the right side have anything good? Um, so I've pulled a full art trainer gallery and a full art. Hmm. Am I gonna get a rainbow? So far, I've pulled a rainbow in every booster box. Or the first two. Link in the description, guys. Link in the description. Would I pull another one in this one? I feel like I don't. I feel like that full art took that rainbow slot. Shanks, reverse hunting gloves, and a light pod. Darkness energy. So cool. I've lost chain of thought now. After that little ramble, I've lost chain of thought. I've lost what I wanted to talk about. People. Reverse tornadoes, yes, need that. Versus research, or what? what am I doing? I don't need to leave it, not yet. Yes, brilliant stars, guys. Brilliant stars is just absolutely phenomenal. The pull rates, the Zards, the Arceuses, the Trainer Galleries. Brilliant, pun intended. Now the stars need to align. And give me a rainbow rare, another full art, or something that I need for my binder, or even a gold card. Actually, no, you can't pull two gold cards in one booster box, no way. Also, on another note, as well, speaking of content creators, um, I recently watched a live PokeRev do his. Astral Radiance, is it? No, Battle Region, Battle Region Opening, trying to complete his master set See, that's content right there, I like that And those hits Oh my days Wimsy Clock, me full up Yes! Badly centered Badly centered But A full up Wimsy Clock Finally, two full arts in one Yes, this is what I wanted to see this is what I wanted to see. So in my first two, I didn't get any full arts. And from the content that I've watched, people are getting two full arts, three full arts, four full arts. And I wasn't getting any until this booster box, finally. So I get... Is that... So you're either going to pull... A few full arts in one box. Or you're going to pull a rainbow plus two V stars maybe. Or even three V stars in my case. Or a sh almost saw there. Reverse back Rosanna's back up. Zamazenta V, I think that's a double up. That's a double up. Yep. Or you're gonna pull a big ton of V's so far from a little bit of research that I've been doing. Which I'm actually kind of fine about. So if you don't... If you don't get a full art, you're more than likely getting a rainbow rare. Um, and a few Vs, but there's only four Vs, so you probably buy... Like me, I've already collected all the V-stars. And then a couple of double-ups as well. Money's Pride, Reverse, and a Muck. Yeah, I've pulled a couple, um, I've pulled all the V-Stars and then a couple doubles as well, so, in that case, with the four V-Stars, 
in my in my case i was lucky to pull pretty much three of them in one box and then the second one or the last one that i needed in another box so that's all the v stars oh, are they? another double up there's another double up of the flareon training gallery card nice i think Clefable. at this point i think i might just start a separate binder I think I was talking, I don't know if, I don't remember when I was talking about it. I think I was talking about it in, um, one of the videos that I did about collecting a new sort of binder instead of just master sets, which I think I might just start doing with the trainer galleries now. Because at this point, depending on how much you open, you're going to be pulling a lot of those. And I think these are actually cheap to buy anyway, singly. So collecting a full master set of them might not be a bad idea and if i can pull most of them at least the big boy here is infernape hollow at least most of the big boy here is and then buy the rest single might not be that expensive and then obviously with the v stars there's only four of those and i've already pulled two doubles so might not even have to pay a single penny extra to get doubles of those depending on how lucky i am with the next few products that i need to get hopefully i can pull a lot of what i need star you and a jolly one and if you guys are currently enjoying the content the brilliant stars content and if you would like to see those when they go live when i can get my hands on those would be really nice if you could like subscribe turn notifications on and then when i do upload those you should be because youtube is sometimes a bit iffy notified when those go live very much appreciate if you did that it helps me and it could also help you three full arts three full arts wait not two technically two no three three full arts in one box yes see I, I, I feel like my theory is right so we have a full art trainer Barry now I'm definitely not gonna get anything else will I get a v-star at least will I even get a v-star probably not Every time I get onto something, a topic, something comes up. I forgot what I was talking about now. And I just messed up again. You idiot! Alright, so will we get a trainer gallery? Okay, that card just dropped on the floor. I'll pick it up later. Yeah, um, reverse clang. Yeah, you can help me and I can help you with entertainment. If you find me entertaining, that is. Hopefully you do. Or hopefully you find my reactions to pulling cards entertaining at least. Maybe my editing. Stuff like that. Just let me know in the comments down below guys, feedback is always welcomed, feedback is always welcomed. Okay. Constructive feedback anyway, not just, not just like, do this, do that, change this, change that. Obviously I'm probably more than likely not going to take that feedback into consideration, but if you give me details and just, you know, let me know what I can do to change certain things, what I could be doing, you know, stuff like that. Just don't tell me what to do, you know what I mean? This box is actually stacked. Holy! Rapid Strike Usher V. Yes! Another trainer gallery that I need. Oh my days! Anything on the back? Muffin. Literally, I've pulled three doubles. Four doubles, three doubles, four doubles, and then the rest are big hitters that I need. Oh my days. 
This is it. This is it. I'm really excited to open more. I'm really, really, really excited to open more. I really want to know how those um half booster boxes are gonna fare up. With how the full booster box is firing up with this many hits. Will a half booster box have this many? But then again. One, two, three, four, five, five. About a very so Zekrom and a big barrel hollow. So I pulled three of these now. Actually, that just reminded me. I haven't pulled the Oranguru. And I have seen in every video, I mean literally, I think every video, one of those have been pulled. Literally every video, a booster box has one of those. Whether the person is opening multiple, high five, or even one. Their first booster box, the second booster box, whichever, it, it's always Oranguru. But not me. I haven't pulled Oranguru in the amount of packs I've opened. Trap Inch, Reverse Chinchino, and a Star Raptor. That one is gonna be my evasion. On, from what looks like it, the easiest, one of the easiest training areas you can pull is gonna be the one that evades me. Fire Energy, Fracture, Tropius, Rosanne's Backup, Turtwig, Sneasel, Clink, Spiritum, Axial, Reverse Monfono. Holy moly! Godly! Mm, mm, words are not coming out of my mouth because of how what but mm, I have pulled three full arts a rainbow and the gold given that gold could have been something else this rainbow could have been something else that Pokemon knows who he is he she I think that's it, done. The, the boost box is done, there's not going to be anything else, no way. Unless this is a god box. Unless this is another god box. Could be a god box. Sigilure. Farfetch'd. Execute. Primer. I think, no, four, four of these. It's about average. Unless I'm going to break the average streak. Yahoo! I am going to break the average streak. Flag on V, yes, one for the binder, all oh my days, two Vs for the binder, oh my, this box, the, do I dare say this one's more on my favourite than the first two, I don't know, pull rate wise and hit wise I think, probably, but card wise like chase cards or s certain cards, like that Kindler could have been Charizard, that Magma Basin could have been Articuno, or even Arceus, and I just... The excitement just... just come on, come on. Made me drop three of the cards, Monferno, Vertic, Trap Pinch. I don't think I'm getting Lost Back Magic guys, I don't think I'm getting Lost Back Magic. Shroomish, I just skipped a few again, Piplop. Reverse Tropius and my motor. Wow. Guys, 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 guys. Time for an epic recap. Alright, guys. The recap. I'm going to start things off with the doubles and the hollows. So, Modres. One, two, three, four, five, six hollows. Which I'm going to say is average, probably. Trainer Gallery, that's a double, Therion, double, Damazenta V, double, Gramble V, double, Luminion V, double, 
gold secret rare magma basin double Zerud V. This is where I need them and I'm gonna add them to the binder. So as a root V. So that's four. Five V's. Jotion. Rapid Strike Oshivu. Cafe Master. That's five training galleries as well. Yep, five training galleries. One. Full art berry. Whimsical V full art. And a cute, really, really cute Pikachu full art. This this Pikachu is really, really nice. And then we have a Rainbow Rare Kindler. Wow, this box. Rarity and pool wise, I think this box has been the best one. In terms of Pokemon. And yeah, in terms of Pokemon, I guess. Maybe not that bad. Not that bad. But if it had all the Pokemon, let's just say the big hit, the big hit Pokemon. Whew, this would have been God Box. But on that note, guys, if you enjoyed the video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. And when the new products come out and I get them in my hands, you'll be notified. Peace.